Hey folks, and welcome back to part two of our dive into the best of Cancun's kids-free, adults-only, all-inclusive resorts. For those of you who haven't seen part one yet, don't worry. We've included the link for you in the description box below, and we'll pop it up at the end of this video. Also, as we do with all of our lists, this one was created based on thousands of guest reviews from the three most popular hotel booking sites, Booking.com, Kayak.com, TripAdvisor.com, and also YouTube guest comments. And as we stated in our previous videos, because of personal taste, one person's favorite resort can easily be another's least favorite. So because of this fact, we'll be counting down our picks based on the highest to lowest price instead of least to most favorite. But keep in mind, folks, room rates will always vary depending on the time of year you visit and plenty of other factors. Now, with all that out of the way, let's get started. Kicking things off at number eight and by far the most expensive resort on this list is Hotel X Carriage Arte with an average price of $1,013 per night. When booking your stay at Hotel X Carat Arte, it's important to know that the difference between X Carat Arte and Hotel X Carat is that X Carat Arte is adults only. However, when you book a stay at X Carat Arte, you gain access to the entire X Carat resort complex, including Hotel X Carat, all of its pools, restaurants, and bars, as well as all of its perks and amenities such as Excelha, Explore, Explore Fuego, and Zensis. These parks host tons of activities like adventures through the forest in amphibious vehicles, snorkeling, zip lining, exploring cenotes, tours through Mayan ruins, and more. Excarat Arte is made up of different houses with four different rooftops, each one with a pool, bar, and rooftop area to check out. And in case you're wondering about the Arte name, that's actually one of the draws of this particular resort. X Carat Arte provides loads of art classes such as dance, weaving, pottery painting, and literature workshops and classes. You also get non-motorized water sports with your all-inclusive package, so you can hit the water with paddle boards and kayaks. And you definitely won't get bored with food choices, because there are 10 different restaurants to choose from, five of which are fine dining options that require reservations. You can try everything from Mexican, Japanese, international, traditional Oaxacan, and vegan options. And with 24-7 room service, you don't even have to leave your room to enjoy a delicious meal. One of the most enticing aspects for some people is the El Deseo Bar. During the evening, it's a speakeasy with live jazz music, but later in the night, it transforms into a nightclub with a live DJ. But if you're not in the mood for lively music and parties, then you can lounge next to the beach or head to the Mullock Spa with natural cave treatment rooms, eco-integrator hydrotherapy rituals, an alchemist room, and a range of massages and treatments. At number 7, we have Excellence Playa Mujeres, average price $562 per night. This gigantic 450-room resort is located in Playa Mujeres which is the private resort community just north of Cancun. And because it's a little outside of Cancun, it's not as loud as some of the hotels in town, which is part of its appeal to many people. The first thing you'll notice about your room at Excellence is how big it is. The junior suites start at 807 square feet and every room has a furnished balcony or patio, marble tile flooring, spacious whirlpool tubs, rainfall showers big enough for two people, and separate water closets. There are swim-up suite options and the two-story suites have rooftop terraces complete with plunge pools and showers. And one of the most unique features is the cubbies beside the entryway for room service deliveries, which provides extra privacy. The resort's beach is the ideal place to relax and soak up the sun with palapas, day beds, sun loungers, massage areas, and a snack grill. There are an impressive seven pools here, and four of them are heated for winter months. There are also four separate hot water whirlpools and five whirlpools that are integrated into the pools, as well as a lazy river. The huge 3,500 square foot gym is open 24 hours and has a ton of exercise equipment and offers different classes like aerobics and yoga, plus a fitness trail. And there's no shortage of activities either, like non-motorized water sports, archery, and Spanish lessons. 
and you can enjoy nightly entertainment at the theater on site. One of the resort's standout features is the Meal Spa, where you can enjoy couples spa suites, a hydrotherapy pool with a bubble massage bench, and high-pressure hoses, a cold plunge pool, steam baths, Swedish saunas, and more. And if all that weren't enough, there are nine different restaurants that include buffets and a la carte restaurants, 11 bars, the beach grill, and 24-hour room service, so you'll never go hungry or go without a drink in your hand. At number six is Breathless Riviera Cancun, with an average price of $465 per night. If you're looking for a big resort with a party atmosphere, then Breathless Riviera might be right up your alley. It features things like a huge 35-person whirlpool, nine bars, an around-the-clock DJ, and go-go dancers so the party never stops. Rooms come with furnished terraces or balconies, mini bars stocked with Coke and Corona products, free Wi-Fi, and walk-in marble showers with glass walls separating them from the bedroom. The showers and bathroom don't provide a lot of privacy, but that can be a good thing if you're there either by yourself or on a romantic vacation. There are three pools on site, all of which are heated, have loungers, cabanas, in-water sunbeds, and other seating, and one of the pools is an optional topless one. The beach features lounges shaded by palapas and hot tubs are spread all around the property as well. The gigantic communal whirlpool is where champagne parties are held each afternoon with the added touch of go-go dancers and foam parties. The fitness center is equipped with a nice selection of fitness machines and workout classes and outdoor activities like tennis, golf, beach volleyball, in addition to water aerobics, dance and aerobics classes are included as well. Daily events range from circus performers to magicians to fire dancers to live music. The all-night party features a live DJ and live art and aerial performances, and on Frisky Fridays, there's a sensuality show. There are 10 different restaurants, six of which are a la carte and feature Middle Eastern, French, Italian, Pan-Asian, and Mexican cuisines, plus a beachside grill, buffet, and a cafe. Nine bars are on-site, including a champagne bar, sports bar, nightclub, and rooftop lounge. And if you need to get away from the party, the spa features 14 treatment rooms where you can get facials, body wraps, and a variety of massages. Coming in at number 5 is the Royal Tin Sheet Cancun, average price $441 a night. Royal Tin Sheet Cancun is truly a party resort, and we recommend you take advantage of the Diamond Club option because it comes with its own private beach area with service, an exclusive lounge with both local and international liquors, discounts at the spa, and the Level 18 Lounge, which is a rooftop cabana lounge. It has a rooftop pool, luxurious cabanas, a premium drink menu, a nightclub feel, and modern dining. You also have options to rent cabanas at Level 18, where you can get service from the waitstaff, a dip pool, dining and drink options, and a sectional lounge, or a beach cabana. Aside from Level 18, there are 10 restaurants featuring Italian, Mexican, Asian, and international options, as well as a steakhouse and a sports bar. And counting Level 18, there are three pools at Royalton Chic, and you don't have to wander far to get a drink because there are 16 bars, including swim-up bars, nightclubs like the Excess Disco Bar, which is great if you want to go dancing, and a beach bar. There's a spa, a nice-sized gym and tennis courts, it's important to note that Royal Tin Sheik is part of a bigger resort, with locations where kids are allowed. However, there are three adults-only pools, hot tubs and swim-up bars, and more. And there are themed pool parties and parties on the beach just for the adults, and they can get pretty wild. You also get $50 of free play each night at the Casino Del Mar, as well as other entertainment like live music, various shows, dinner on the beach, and a sky champagne party on the Sky Terrace every week. Sitting at number 4 is Sun Palace, average price $423 a night. If you're looking for a couples-only resort right in the hotel zone, Sun Palace is the perfect spot. Rooms have private balconies with hot tubs, big jet tubs just off the bed area, double basin sinks, and frosted glass doors for bathroom vestibules with walk-in showers that feature benches and soap shelves. But by far, or at least as we see it, 
The biggest draw of Sun Palace is its wide, white sand beach with lounge chairs and shady umbrellas, which isn't as crowded or noisy as some of the beaches on the north end of the hotel zone. There are also three infinity pools, one of which is near the ocean, and the resort's spa has 10 treatment rooms, a salon, steam room, sauna, and whirlpool, while the gym is roomy and features natural light with a variety of machines and weights. Amongst the many dining options, there's an Italian restaurant, surf and turf, breakfast and lunch buffets, Mexican cuisine, as well as a lobby bar, a poolside bar with snacks, and a swim-up bar. But there are more things to do than just play volleyball. There's also karaoke and bingo on the beach, as well as nightly entertainment like music, shows, or circus acts that feature magicians, jugglers, and fire dancers. Landing at number three, we have the TRS Coral with an average price of $415 a night. The TRS Coral is outside the hotel zone in Playa Mujeres, making it a little quieter than some of the more popular options downtown. It's got a funky retro atmosphere and it's mostly a quiet environment. But that doesn't mean it's stiff. The 469 suites come with either a terrace or a balcony, with some suites being swim outs. All of the rooms have soaking tubs with separate walk-in showers with rainfall shower heads and a separate toilet area. And if you're looking for rooms with plenty of space, they have two-story loft suites with a jacuzzi terrace as well. TRS's pristine beach is great for relaxation or fun and has umbrellas, lounge chairs, and beach beds. And even better is that the staff does an amazing job of removing the seaweed. The main pool has submerged loungers as well as both single and double lounge chairs that are nice for poolside cuddling. TRS has seven different restaurants, two buffets, Indian, Thai, Japanese, and Italian options, as well as an Argentinian steakhouse. The resort is also located next to the family-friendly Grand Palladium Costa Mujeres Resort and Spa, which you have full access to, and many of its amenities are located there like the spa, gym, and also the nightlife entertainment. That means that anything located there isn't adults only. The spa and wellness center at the Palladium include a hydrotherapy circuit and a number of treatments and lots of exercise equipment, as well as a tennis center with eight whole courts and instruction. So along with the Palladium, you have access to 18 bars, including a beach club and a 24-hour sports bar. But one of the best extras is a free night at Chic Cabaret, where you can get a multi-course gourmet meal as well as outstanding live performances. At number two is Haven Riviera, average price $303 per night. Just south of Cancun, Haven Riviera is a great, quiet, and secluded option. All of its 333 rooms have balconies or terraces with sliding glass doors that lead out to whirlpool tubs or which come with swim-up pool access. Rooms come with free Wi-Fi, a free welcome bottle of mezcal, and bathrooms with marble floors, granite countertops and double vanities, backlit mirrors, and walk-in rainfall showers. You have two pool options, a lap pool and a main pool with zero entry access and submerged loungers. There's also a communal pool for rooms with swim-out access, But if you'd rather hang out on the beach, you'll find beach beds with lounge chairs. Also, if you upgrade to the Serenity Club, you get additional perks like exclusive lounges and reception areas, free use of the pool circuit, and a private section of the beach that comes with butler service. Wellness options at the resort include the My Senses Spa, with massages, manicures, and hydrotherapy, as well as a fitness center. And when it comes to restaurants, there's a buffet restaurant, a restaurant facing the ocean, a Mediterranean option, an Asian fusion option, a snack bar, a deli, several bars, and a nightclub where music and comedy shows are featured. It's a good, low-key option for vacationers who want a relaxing environment. And coming in at number one on our list is Ocean Maya Royale, with an average price of $220 per night. Even though the Ocean Maya Royale can have an active atmosphere at times, it's got a mostly peaceful vibe. The resort's beach has a nice long walkway that concludes with a jetty that extends out into the water, 
a beach volleyball court and shaded hammocks for ultimate beachside relaxation. It's only 15 minutes from Playa del Carmen, where all the bars, restaurants, and shopping are found. There's a whole range of activities to take part in like tennis lessons, windsurfing, kayaking, snorkeling, water polo, aerobics, and there's even a shuttle that takes you to the local shopping centers. For nightly entertainment like live music, traditional Mexican performances, and other shows, head to the on-site theater. And for all of you pool sharks out there, you can find tables in the bar area. The resort has two pools, which may not be as many as other mega resorts, but they're decked out luxe with palapas, lounge chairs, and a swim-up bar. And the resort's spa offers hydrotherapy, massages, and treatments, plus it has a hot tub on the roof with a gorgeous and inviting deck. Of course, there's a nice variety of restaurants to try, like a poolside buffet and other buffet options, a Mexican option, a Japanese restaurant, a fusion cuisine option, a coffee shop, sort of like Starbucks, and a fruit and juice bar, in addition to the lobby bar that serves food and drink 24-7. Well, folks, that wraps up our list. Thanks for watching and safe travels.